let the celebration begin. Until the end of July, Norfolk Public Libraries will be celebrating the namesakes and neighborhoods of their various library branches. Across Norfolk, residents gathered to commemorate their neighborhood library with the dedication of a new branch plaque. At each event, ceremony programs included guest speakers' namesake relatives, displays, entertainment, and refreshments. Several branches even have youth and family-oriented events in conjunction with their dedication ceremony. These celebrations serve to honor men like Horace C. Downing, whom the Branch Library in Berkeley, Norfolk was named after. Person after person stepped up to the podium to share about the impact that was made by just one individual. Each speaker shared their admiration for Mr. Downing and reflected on highlights of his legacy. Here at the Horace C. Downing Branch Library, which was named after one of our foot soldiers, Mr. Horace C. Downing, we named it for him because of all of the civil and community work he did. Mainly he did uh, voter registration. Uh, some of the young people now that maybe be in, in their 60s say how Mr. Downing helped them register to vote. We're working with our local politicians and uh, city councilmen to get some things done. And we're just proud of him, proud of his family, the legacy that he leaves. And I just want to continue as long as I can to work with the people in the community. The legacy, the history of Berkeley, and a great, great, great pioneer, Parsi Downing. You will have to see the old Berkeley to understand his legacy to see the new birth. I see the young pioneers are coming forward now to be a part of the community. Mr. Downing was my political mentor. We really just need to make sure that we take advantage of our libraries. I go back to the times when it was, it was against the law for blacks to know how to read. This library and, and what we are uh, about to uh, embark on is gonna be a game changer as it relates to information, as it relates to civility and decent behavior. These are some of the principles that Mr. Downing instilled in us. Norfolk Public Libraries would like to encourage all Norfolk residents to get to know your local library by visiting and joining. For more information about Norfolk Public Libraries, please visit www.norfolkpubliclibrary.org. For Norfolk News Now, I'm Chris Free.